All right, so this next problem, you are planning to use a ceramic tile um, designed in your bathroom. Um, the tiles are blue with white equilateral triangles. Um, you decide to arrange the blue tiles in a hexagonal shape as shown. If each side of each tile measures 7 centimeters, what will the exact area of the um, each hexagonal shape be? Well, so you're really just... Um, not worried about the colors, you're basically looking at finding the area of this, right? The color information is really extra. So in a word problem, you always want to figure out what the important information is. Well, it's a hexagon, and it says it's equilateral, so you know that the formula for this is area, or you should know, equals apothem times perimeter divided by 2. Perimeter, everyone should be able to get. So um, perimeter for a hexagon, well there's six sides, each side is seven centimeters, so that would be basically um, six sides times seven each would make the apothem 42 centimeters long. Okay, so that's the apothem, 42 centimeters. We can even write that there. Next, we want to figure out what the apothem is, or apothem, sorry, and that's just the height of this triangle in here. So if I were to think of an equilateral triangle in the center, it's just basically going to be the height. Well, when you cut that in half, you know that you get a 30, 60, 90 degree triangle. Well, if this side is 7 and you just cut it in half with this, um, this side right here should be 3.5, which is the shortest side on this triangle. Well, you're trying to find this side, the apothem, and so what you do is you use the rules of a 30, 60, 90, and if you know the shortest side, the height, the perpendicular leg, the medium side, would be radical 3 times that. So the apothem, apothem equals 3.5 times radical 3. So now we have the apothem here. We have the perimeter up here. And all of these can be separate questions on their own. Now we want to combine the two questions, the two answers together, use this formula right here to find the area. So area equals apothem 3.5 radical 3 times the perimeter 42 divided by Two. Now most of the time you'll simplify the top first. So 3.5 times 42, if you take out your calculator, which you're allowed to use, and do 3.5 times 42, you get 147 radical 3. And that's divided by 2. Now you could divide this by 2, but this is pretty much as far as I want you to go on the test. So this would be an acceptable answer, and hopefully you'll remember those steps. It's basically, it's a word problem, but um, you really just have to find the area.